they know that I'm on a magic mountain. So many calls, man, I stop counting. All right, we're gonna attempt this one while driving. All right, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna attempt it while driving. As always, shout out Uncle Lou. Shout out Uncle Lou for the Your Season Is Over idea. It's his video, it's his idea. I just wanted to create my own. I say this every video. Um, but yeah, uh, Uncle Lou does the best Your Season Is Over videos in the world. No one's ever coming close. I just wanted to spin, do my own spin on it, man. Look, <laughs> traffic, <Hi. laughs> traffic. Oh, this is it's Up oh, first, Illinois, you go in and you lose to Oregon 38 to nine. I mean, it is what it is. We knew you were gonna lose. You stood no chance against the number one team in the country. I did think your defense would play better than that. Allowing 38 points, I didn't see that coming. You were a 22 point underdog. I was like, yeah, no way. Illinois is gonna play some defense and keep this a close game. Yeah, I was completely wrong. Oregon shut you out. Um, and that's a conference loss for you, Illinois. So it is what it is. It is only your second loss, so we'll see. But uh, yeah, I, I think that's, um, yeah, Illinois, your season's over. <laughs> Losing to the number one team in Oregon's not bad, but uh, it is your second loss and it is a conference loss. Wisconsin, you fought hard, didn't you, boy? You fought real hard against Penn State. I don't know what Penn State's doing, almost losing to Wisconsin. Alabama goes in and blows Wisconsin out and then you got Penn State over here struggling. I don't know what's going on, but uh, shout out Wisconsin for trying, but <laughs> your season's over, Wisconsin, and it was over uh, the last two games you lost, pimp. Uh, thing is, this is a conference loss this time, so your season's definitely over, Wisconsin. Have fun with that. Nebraska. <laughs> um, yeah, you lost. Uh, I guess you, you fought hard, too. You made it close. Shout out to Nebraska. They, they fought hard against uh, Ohio State. Had chances to win the game, honestly. Had chances to win the game, and they didn't. Um, Ohio State puts them away 21-17. to That is Nebraska's third loss, I want to say. Uh, it's pretty bad, man, but... If Nebraska could go 9-3, and 8-4, and four, that's still a very good season for them, man. I don't know the rest of their schedule, but still a very good season for them. So shout out Nebraska, even though they lost, and their season is over because that was a, another conference loss. But uh, Matt Rule might be building something up there, man. Year, we'll see year three what happens next year. Um, and shoot, they for all we know, they could surprise everyone and run the table and, and maybe do something. We'll see. Shout out Nebraska, though. We'll see. Your season is over. I'm not going to lie to you, but we'll see. Vanderbilt, I hate doing this, man, because Vanderbilt, <sighs> Cinderella story, it's pretty much over now. They got three or four losses. Um, still got to play LSU. Maybe you can do some. I hope not. <laughs> I hope my LSU Tigers blow you out, but we'll see. Vanderbilt, your season is over. You did go and lose to Texas, and you made it close, and I'm proud of you, and I like that you did that because I really wanted you to win this game. Unfortunately, you couldn't pull it off, um, but uh, either way, it was still a very good game. Sorry. Still a very good game. And shout out Vanderbilt for competing in the SEC this year. They're, they're not an easy team um, like they were. Not the worst team in the SEC like they usually are. It's Mississippi State, Auburn, or Oklahoma. Pick your poison, you feel me? Maybe Kentucky. Pick your poison. But it is not Vanderbilt. So shout out Vanderbilt. But unfortunately, you did lose. It is your third or fourth loss. And your season is over, Vandy. Cinderella story, uh, or Cinderella story is also all over. Um, and again, that may be unfortunate to hear. And it is unfortunate. But... Your season's over, Vandy. LSU, by God, I can go on for days about this one. No run game. No run game at all. Um, three interceptions by Nussmeyer. Special teams don't want to play ball. People keep saying LSU, uh, Texas A&M is the better team. Texas A&M is dangerous. I hate to tell you this, but LSU wins if they play again this Saturday. LSU wins. Um, I think they're the better team. Texas A&M looks good. LSU just made simple mistakes that had they not made, the game would have been won by LSU, and it's that simple. No, I know. That sounds like an excuse. It's not. Shout out Texas A&M. They, they did what they had to do and win the game. Um, it's just simple mistakes that LSU makes every damn time, and, it, and it's so annoying. It's so annoying, bro. Just do your job. Execute. Play football, man. Stop. This ain't tennis, bruh. This ain't no soft ass sport, and no offense to tennis players, but they ain't got no business playing football. I'm so tired of this soft ass team, bro. If, if we just execute, that's been our only problem, bro. It's not like we got beat by a better team. We didn't. 
In fact, we lost to a worser team than us. LSU is a really, very good team, and so is Texas A&M. I just think LSU is still better, and we lost. It's on. It's it's, on, it's ridiculous. Um, LSU, we deserve better as LSU fans, but whatever. I mean, I, I still want Brian Kelly to stay where he is. I still want Nussmeyer to be our starting quarterback, so people need to chill out with that shit. Um, but our season may be over, honestly. We might not make the playoffs. There's a chance we don't make the SEC championship. Our season dead ass might be over, bro. <laughs> I don't think it is. I still think we have a chance, but we keep losing like this. We ain't gonna, yeah, we ain't gonna do, be doing shit. We gotta beat Bama here in two weeks. We'll see what happens. But as for now, you did make this list um, because you lost yesterday, so therefore your season's over in terms of video wise. Um, may not actually be over, but in terms of this video, your season is over at LSU. Um, and that's unfortunate, but fuck it. Navy, not much to say here. It's Navy. They lost. Okay, get over it. Um, got blew out by Notre Dame, and I think we put too much hype on Navy. I think we're putting too much hype on Army. I don't think Army's going to do much better than Navy did uh, against Notre Dame. We'll see. Maybe I'm wrong, but Navy, your season is over in terms of playoffs or uh, or anything, really. I mean, maybe you get the, the conference championship against Army. We'll see. But for, in terms of this video, your season is over, Navy. Missouri, Missouri, Missouri. No offense, no demand yesterday. Even with your starting quarterback, I don't want to hear that shit. Um, we only lost because Brady Cook got hurt. No, he, he started. He's just ass. No, he's not ass. <laughs> but he couldn't do anything yesterday against the Alabama defense, which is crazy because Alabama's defense is not amazing. Um, unfortunately for Missouri, they took an L here, and they're just going to have to get over it. That's their second L. I think it's their, yeah, it's their second conference loss. That's two conference losses for Missouri. Season might be over, buddy. In fact, it is over because you're on this video. You're on this list. Missouri, your season is over. Do better on offense. You have too many uh, key players on offense to be this bad. Kind of reminded me of LSU's defense. So much talent, but can't do shit. <laughs> but uh, you lost. You lost to Alabama, and you didn't look good at all. At all. Your defense played well in the first half. But that's about it, man. That's all I can give you. Missouri, your season is over, buddy. Snap back to reality. Oh, there goes gravity. Missouri so ass. Missouri, your season's over. Duke. I hate doing this, too, because Duke is a good team. Um, and they, they, you know, I think they only had one loss, maybe two coming into this game. Um, who'd they lose to? Lost to SMU. That's not a bad loss. And you lost in overtime. Shout out Duke, man. Uh, unfortunately, you didn't make this list, though. So your season is over. Um, so, yeah, your season is over. But... I'll give you props where it's due. You competed in this game and stayed in it and had a chance to win it. Shout out Duke, man. Kentucky, I was just talking about you, man. Might be the worst team in the SEC. It's either Kentucky, Auburn, Oklahoma, or Mississippi State. It's one of those teams. Pick your poison. <laughs> Kentucky's not good, man. Kentucky's not good. And they lost yesterday to another terrible team. Like I said, a team that maybe is worse than them. Auburn's not good at all. And you lost to them. Um, so, Kentucky, your season's been over, but it's definitely over now. It's definitely over now. You might as well give on up, turn in your pads and helmets, <laughs> and uh, watch the rest of the season from uh, from the break room, I guess. Um, but, Kentucky, your season's over. Have fun. And I added this one on here just for laughs. Uh, Utah. It really is not fun to laugh at Utah until now because now you're just losing stupid games. You know, Utah was picked to win the Big 12. Um... And they come out, catch a few losses, and you're like, okay, well, their season's over, but maybe, you know, they can run the rest of the, run the table, win the rest of their games or whatever, and at least, at least make it fun. No, no, what do they do? Come out and lose to fucking Houston. Not Whitney Houston, Houston. What are you talking about? Utah, what are you doing? I didn't watch this game. I didn't even know nothing about it. Did Cam Rising play? If not, that explains it. And if he did, damn. Ha, <laughs> ha, Utah, if, if Cam Rising did play and you still lost this game to Houston, you're just ass, my dude. You're garbage as fuck. Utah does not need to be losing to games like Houston or losing to teams like Houston. That's ridiculous. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Utah, uh, your season's over, bub. Cry about it. Complain about it. I don't care. I, I like your coach and Cam Rising, I guess. 
Better luck next year in your 10th year in, the, in college, I guess. I, Utah, your season's over, bro. Your season's over. All right, who won but looked bad yesterday? Penn State. You had chances to lose to Wisconsin. You better chill out with all that talking. I don't want to hear nothing from Penn State until they beat Ohio State this year. Um, if you lose to Ohio State here this uh, coming up week, your season's going to be over. Uh because uh, you'll be on this list, but also because you won't make the conference title game. It'll be Oregon and Ohio State. But you did win overall, even though it was, it was a little too close for comfort. You did win, so fair enough. But if you ask me, I wouldn't be too comfortable with a two-touchdown win over Wisconsin. Alabama came and blew this team out, pimp. Blew them out. And you, and you beat them by two touchdowns. So uh, have at it what you will, Penn State, but uh, I'd be careful, buddy. Miami. Miami, Miami, Miami. You're going to lose the game. You keep messing around. I'm for real. You won this game by a lot, but you still play terrible, dude. I, I don't know what it is with Miami, man. These close games are getting annoying. I think it was like 36-7, 36-14 or something. I mean, they, they won pretty comfortably, but they're going to lose a game if they keep messing around. That's all I'm saying. Miami, I would, I would stop all that woofing. I ain't going to lie to you. Stop all that woofing on the net. Thought you was a thug. Kansas State, almost losing to Kansas. That's ridiculous. Kansas State's probably the favorite to win the Big 12, and you out here almost losing to Kansas. Kansas ain't good anymore. This ain't 2022 Kansas. This ain't 2023 Kansas. It's 2024 Kansas, and they're not that good. Kansas State, I'd stop woofing on the net. Thought you was a thug. Michigan. Almost lost to Michigan State. Again, this is not the good Michigan State. This is 2024 Michigan State, and they're not that good. Well, you're not that good either, are you, Michigan? Already got three losses. Michigan, stop talking. Sharon Moore won't be there long, apparently. I don't see him staying there longer than three or four years, bro. Sharon Moore might have to get on gone. But anyway, that's all I got, man. Uh, let me know if I missed something. Uh, let me go back over the season's over. Um, Utah, your season's over. Kentucky, your season is over. Duke, your season is over. Missouri, your season is over. Navy, your season is over. LSU, your season is over. Vandy, your season is over. Nebraska, your season is over. And Illinois, your season is over. Let me know if I missed something, man. Let's look at the stats. I've got the facts. My money like Liz, my pockets are fat. Homie, I'm epic. Don't be a whap. Dog, it's a yarmulke. Homie, no cap.